Слово предоставляет Случайно Доратти, профессор школы библиотечных архивов информационных исследований Университета Британской Колумбии. Thank you. Thank you to the organizers for inviting me to this great conference and for inviting me to Kazan, such an amazing city. So, uh, in the past decades, archivists have focused on the development of trusted digital repositories and of requirements for the continued trustworthiness of records. Now, this is still necessary, but it is no longer sufficient. Uh, it is important that we have in-house repositories for records that are sensitive, that are covered by privacy, and so on. However, we must focus on reliable, universal access to our infrastructure for document archives. So, in this day and time, we are created in the cloud. Yet, as you work in your phones, uh, we need to establish our archives in a cloud. With providers that will leave to us the control of all the functions, but that will offer the services that we need. And we must develop tools to nudge the people towards the archival cloud and towards the sources of evidence that are stored there. This might involve slicing and dicing the records aggregations for targeted audiences, like Facebook does, or to develop a blueprint for characterizing the components of the archival cloud for different groups of users, like Wikipedia does or to develop capabilities that enable governments and people to trace, access, and assess the reliability, the authentic accuracy of records in context, click after click, like Google does. So this that the archival profession needs to embrace. Our surveys have shown that a large percentage of archivists with formal archival education work in information governance and in records management. A large number of people are Hello. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, many archivists work with firms that develop record keeping and preservation and all sorts of tools like forensic tools have a work. Many work like privacy officers. Now, we need our identity as archivists, not as a stable thing. You have to think of it as a narrative, as a story, as the result of international and interdisciplinary conversations over And this is why Interfares, the research project that I direct since and which involves about 500 researchers in 42 countries, among which Russia, um, has focused its study how the environment on technological means of authentication like blockchain, on artificial intelligence, and on access. So the convergence of record keeping and archival preservation in an archival cloud would enhance the visibility and impact of the mission which is central, enduring, and distinctive to the identity of our profession, to safeguard and make accessible the documentary truth. At the same time, archival institutions will continue to serve, exhibit, and nurture the use of the original of non-digital records, while its space will have to be increased 
for civic, cultural and educational activities, among which a priority will be providing people with the digital literacy necessary for them to evaluate the sources of information.